got mine here. Vaccination cards. They're handed out, filled out, or given a sticker when you get your COVID shots. But what exactly should you do with yours after you're fully vaccinated? I keep mine in my wallet. Andrew Cox, Macomb County's health officer, carries his with him. But Hakeem Barry, the COO of the city of Detroit, stashed his away. I have laminated mine and put it in our uh, safekeeping place in our homes. While it's still unclear just what the cards will be needed for, jobs, travel, normal life activities, there's still an understanding that this is important and should be kept safe in case it's required down the road. Not knowing means I will hold on to it and, and hold it as, as treasure. But while it's clear proof of vaccination is important, officials say you don't need to stress if you lose it. Not to worry about that. Uh, we, we have the ability to look up that record. Local health departments, health care providers, and pharmacies all have access to the Michigan immunization record. And within 24 hours from vaccination, we enter your record into that database. So proof that you've been vaccinated can be easy to find, but getting that new card, well, that can be trickier. We don't have extra vaccine cards. So with each kit of the vaccine comes that same allotment of vaccines cards. A new card would have to be ordered by your provider from the CDC, a hassle for sure, which is why you're being encouraged to take care of your card once you get it. Laminating your record card is important because it'll keep it safe and durable um, through what may be repeated use and uh, over time. From now until May 1st, staple stores all across the country are offering to laminate vaccine cards for free. While I certainly don't have any extra insight or knowledge about how we'll use these vaccine cards in the future, um, I can't see any, um, any downside into doing something that'll keep them safe and make sure that they'll be in good condition for years to come. And while card requirements have yet to crop up, incentives are already here. A lot of people have these vaccination cards, so we've had a lot of people come in and show us their cards. Jerry Millen's dispensary, Greenhouse of Walled Lake, is offering a free pre-roll joint to anyone 21 and up with proof of vaccination. The program, which ends next week, is called Pots for Shots, and they've already given out more than 6,000 joints. We always look out for patients, so we have a lot of senior citizens that shop at the Greenhouse here at Walled Lake. I said, you know what, why not, record, why not reward some of these patients for getting their shots? So the bottom line is this, hold on to your vaccine card, but if you do lose it, think of it like a passport. It is a headache to replace, but it can be done. We're in Detroit tonight, I'm Ross Jones, 7 Action News.